Hi, welcome. I was trying to make a tutorial and that's the last way or third way, well, maybe not the last, but it's certainly the third way to install a theme. So if we made the tutorials about Helium, Helium is this look and you can install it with Software Center here. You can install it by going to kde.store.org, second way. And the third way is of course, of course, of course, use AOR. So I tried to make a tutorial, I did make a tutorial, I deleted everything back because there are issues, errors. When you install this particular thing, it will result in errors. And even if you solve those errors, it will lead in a wrong URL. So never mind. We'll just look for another theme to show you how to install Plasma themes. So Plasma, well, the themes is maybe too much Plasma theme, right? You open it up, make it very big, and then you scroll up and you take your time to explore all of them. I don't have the time. But the thing that says, when it says orphans, it means nobody's taking care of it anymore. So uh, that's the only thing you need to watch out for. Out of date does not mean necessarily that it's bad. It just means that there's a new version and that the version you install is then this version which might just be 2.0.3.2, no, so no biggie. Just depends how long it was, how, how long ago it was out of date. This is installed, new mix KDE, we've done that, we've shown that, it's beautiful. And there are other things here as well. So let's just take one that I really don't know what's gonna happen. So that's a surprise for me as well. How about Plasma Theme Arch Linux 13? Number 13, lucky number 13. So, can we install themes? Yes, sure we can. If everything works, if the package build works, if the manager from the package build on the AUR takes care of everything, then we have something. And here we have even uh, some communication here. To use this theme, select and apply the theme in the wallpaper, system settings, workspace appearance, desktop theme, Arch Linux, desktop settings, background, Arch Linux. All right, so let's keep it open just to see what it was again, and you see a little notice down there. Yeah, I've seen it. Update your system. Oh, I should type, make a new alias for my typos. So, update. Uh, just these two guys, fine. Let's see if AOR has anything to update. Ah, uh, fine, so we're done. That's how we update. Now, we've installed something, let's have a look. System settings, workspace, something about Arch Linux. Don't, ah, here it is. Apply, one, two, three. And there you are. Let's get that out of the way. This is the Arch Linux look. It provides us breeze stuff. It's dark. Looks like a breeze dark theme, but might be different in some respects. Desktop theme, Arch Linux, cursor theme, maybe a white one since it's a dark one, a dark uh, theme. Maybe they have created the splash screen as well, let's we take a look. So getting the white one, splash screen, Arch Linux, what do we get then? Oh yeah, right, with this little bar, escape and you quit the video here that we have and that's basically it we have now Arch Linux theme that we've activated so next time when I boot up I'll see this um, little film of Arch Linux in this bar so lots more to explore and not so much time to explore them all you know it's a lot of choices you have to you can you can make can install. Right, have fun with Arco Linux. Cheers!